I take a long elevator ride to the surface and make a few calls to get some help. It's a pretty good time to reflect on all that's happened. It's obvious to me that Margaret injected me for a reason. She knew the man I'd become over the last seven years had become too treacherous to trust anymore, and she was right. That night of the injection, I must have made a deal with the devil to betray her and Mason, and the 50 Gs were my 30 pieces of silver. Margaret knew instinctively I was going to betray them, and that's why she broke away earlier. But I think she also knew that the man I was seven years ago would do the right thing and try to stop the translator. That's why she only erased my memory for the last seven years. I guess each of us had sins we needed to atone for. Now I've got to find out how all of this is going to play out. I know Tex, he's not that kind of guy. He couldn't have killed these folks. Mantis, the Morlock, Tex. I've got witnesses. All right, I'll take your word for it for now, but I'll keep my eye on it before I make any exceptions again. Keep yourself clean. You said I said Chelsea needed someone, but you can give her so much more. Now, I've thought this all through, and the only way that I see this working out is with you getting into that speeder with her. But I... The way that you feel for her, that's what she deserves. I want you two to have what I couldn't. But I... Mason gave me a trans inducer to use in an emergency. It can take her back to the moment where your memory ends and give you both a fresh start. But if... Listen, think of this as your happily ever after ending. But do I have to take your speeder because my speeder's over here? You're on your own from here. Go get your girl. Thanks for helping us out, Blue. My... F I wouldn't have missed this for the while. After I give you the trance inducer, you're, you're gonna be pretty confused. My f thought he was dreaming for a couple of days. That's why I thought having Louie here would help. It's always better to have Louie here. Well, plus, you got that video we took. If my f and I can't convince you, you always got that. Thank you, Louie. You gonna need any help with that injection? I think we got it. I'll be right over here. Chelsea, are you sure about this? I mean, I don't want to change your mind, but this is going to change everything. Like I told you, Tex, if there was a way I could go back in time, I'd do it. I feel kind of bad, you know, about, uh, you know. About Thompson? Yeah. Don't. Because what he and I had won't change. 
It doesn't have to change. I never felt that way about him like I do about you. And he'll always be my very dear friend. And besides, he insists on uh, giving me away. Well, that's good, because if he didn't, I'd have to steal you away. No, no, no. He's giving me away. As in walking down the aisle. Maybe it's not a perfect world, but it's the best I've got. I might have been somebody else over the past seven years, but I'm ready to leave that behind me. I've been given a second chance and I intend to make the most of it. I sense this is just the beginning of something bigger, and what comes next may not be easy. But then again, what is?
now! What's wrong? My speeder! What? It's been stolen! Let's walk. You know, not many people wake up from blackouts with new furniture. And it's a sitting room. Good for sitting. I can't lie to you about your chances, but you have my sympathies. You're a disgrace. Hubba hubba! Just another reason for your mother to be disappointed. I feel like we both accomplished something today. Mostly me, though. I guess we know who the real detective is. Not you. You call yourself a gamer. <sighs> Your father always said you'd end up using the hint button. Ooh, well, this is awkward. It is with great disappointment that I say, well done. Nice pimp mobile, Daffodil. Uh, Tex, is this hell? Because it seems like hell. 
It's okay, honey. We can't all be good at things. Hubba hubba. I'd like to add her biological and technological distinctiveness to my own, if you know what I mean. Your move, creep. This reminds me of that time I turned a tortoise over on its back and wouldn't help it. Why did I do that? You think she'd ever go for a quippy PDA who lives in a pocket? Here you go, you big baby. Don't forget, call mom. Uncouth, underemployed, and unstable. My friend, you've got it all. Aye, Rusty, we hardly knew ye. My most painful childhood memory, it involves this rocking horse. Oh, my ex-wife Sylvia. Thanks to her, I know this I can't tear out your heart. Thanks to her, I know what it's like to have a high heel tear out your heart. Come like a thief in the night, and one by one dropped the revelers, and died each in the despairing posture of his fall. And darkness, and decay, and death held illimitable dominion over all.
extortion memorandum case. What's up with the bed? Looks like it's for a Lothario instead of some hardworking down on his luck PI. Am I going crazy here? 